Electric Vehicle Industry in India. India unveiled National Electric Mobility Mission Plan in 2013 to address the issues of national energy security, vehicular pollution and growth of domestic manufacturing capabilities. Reiterating its commitment to the Paris Agreement, the Government of India has plans to make a major shift to electric vehicles by 2030. E-commerce companies, Indian car manufacturers like Reva Electric Car Company and Indian app-based transportation network companies like Ola are working on making electric cars more common over the next two decades. Industry associations Society of Manufacturers of Electric Vehicles SMEV. Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Electric Vehicle Manufacturers in India, Manufacturers of Electric Vehicles Launched in India Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Fully electric cars The electric cars available in India are Eddy Current Controls, Love Bird Mahindra E20 Plus Mahindra E Verito Tata Tagore Electric Mahindra EKUV100 Tata Tiago Electricisro has tested a solar-powered hybrid car, a modified Maruti Omni with a solar panel platform installed on top of the car. The installation of this solar platform on the car has been rated awful for its design. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Hybrid cars. Below are some of the hybrid cars available in India Toyota Prius Toyota Camry Hybrid BMW i8 Honda Accord Hybrid Scooters The following companies have launched electric scooters in India Avan Motors Hero Electric Hero Moto Corp. Green Zine Tech Sincero B6 Ampere Vehicles 56 Atta Energy Private Limited CEON India 22 Motors Kimco Aera New and Renewable Energy Moto Corp Tech Private Limited Okinawa Autotech Private Limited Yo Bikes e -L -E -C -T -R -O -T -H -E -R -M India Limited Lohia Auto Industries Palatino XXP Law Automotive Private Limited Tunnel E Vehicles Private Limited BSA Motors Discontinued Thunderwind BPG Rexnamo Shimar E Vehicle and Solar Private Limited says ND's Eco Ether Veed Motors Topic Motorcycles The following companies have launched electric motorcycles in India SVM Bikes by Srivaru Motors Private Limited Earth Energy EV to be launched Torque Motors to be launched, M Flux Motors to be launched, Menza Motors, OK Play, Rexnamo, Ultraviolet Automotive (TVS Investment), Darwin, Auxa Energies to be launched. Topic: Bicycles. The following companies have launched electric bicycles in India Electron Cycles Hulakal Electro India Private Limited Ampere Vehicles BSA Motors 
Airbike India Electrotherm Echo Omo Bikes Sparrow Topic Buses India's first electric bus was launched in Bangalore in 2014. Ashok Leyland launched its electric bus in October 2016. Tata Motors launched its pure electric bus, Starbus Electric 9 meters, and hybrid, Starbus Electric 12 meters, in January 2017. Goldstone Infratech supplied Himachal Pradesh Transport Corporation with 25 electric buses in September 2017. 25 made in India. Tata Starbus hybrid electric buses delivered in Maharashtra in March 2018. <inaudible> <inaudible> Mini pickup trucks The following companies have launched electric pickup trucks in India Mahindra, Tata Motors, Ace Electric in 2016, Ashik Leyland, Dust Electric pickup truck. Croyance Automotive, ELECRO1, T India First Electric Cargo Light Truck HTTP colon slash slash www.croyansuto.com Topic Heavy Duty Trucks, Semi Trailer and Tractor Trucks There are no known cases of manufacturing and use of electric heavy-duty trucks, semi-trailers or tractor trucks in India. Rickshaws <inaudible> 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 A Motor Vehicles Amendment Bill was passed by the Parliament in 2015, which established battery-powered e-rickshaws as a valid form of commercial transport in India. With their small size and small turning radius, e-rickshaw is already a popular mode of transport in Delhi NCR, particularly in small lanes and congested areas. The following companies have launched electric rickshaws in India Dilly Electric Auto Private Limited CEEON Indy Adapt Motors Private Limited Volta Motors Kinetic Green Gayam Motor Works REEP Industries, REEP Motors Mahindra Electric Infinite E Solutions Go Green BOV OK Play Atul Auto Limited Railways Indian Railways has a long history of electric locomotives, first use in 1925. On 31 March 2017, government announced that the entire rail network in the country will be electrified by 2022. Indian Railways has successfully tested solar panel mounted trains. Power generated from these solar panels will be used for the lights and fans inside the train. Topic: Solar electric boat. Aditya from Navalt. Topic: Mobility solution providers. In 2015, Bangalore-based Lithium Technologies launched a fully electric taxi service for corporates. In June 2017, Bangalore-based logistic group Baghirati Travel Solutions became the first company in the country to launch electric sedan as a taxi fleet. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Challenges faced. Topic charging infrastructure charging infrastructure for electric vehicles in India has not been fully developed yet. There have been initiatives to set up community charging stations, as in the case of Plug-in India facilitated charging stations. 
News reports have indicated about plans to provide solar-powered charging points at the existing fuel stations of the country, charging infrastructure, mainly setting up of level 2 charging at public level shall be the toughest challenge in terms of service integration for India. For fast DC charging, cost and high renewable energy biggest factors. It is also assumed that 10% of the charging infrastructure required in India shall be composed of fast charging station and rest 90% shall come from level 2 public charging setups. On the 22nd of May 2018, Atta Energy launched its charging infrastructure service in Bangalore called Atta Grid with each charging station called point. The service is open to all electric vehicles but has been deployed where Atta plans to launch its own electric scooter. Topic. Reasons for the shift to clean mobility Air quality indices related to India indicate that the air in many cities of India is no longer healthy. Automobile-related pollution has been one of the causes for this. Aspects related to global warming needs a shift to automobile solutions that reduces, do not produce greenhouse gas emissions. The need to reduce dependency on a fossil fuel-based economy. India's crude oil imports for 2014-15 was $112 billion, approximately 7.000 crore rupees. For comparison, the allocation for the Mahatma Gandhi National Rural Employment Guarantee Scheme in Budget 2017-18 is 48,000 crore rupees. India can become a global provider for clean mobility solutions and processes that are affordable and scalable. People living in some of the Indian cities are being affected by noise pollution. Some of the Indian cities have the worst noise pollution levels in the world. Electric vehicles may contribute to a reduction in noise pollution levels in the cities. Energy efficiency and emission reduction has improved in automobiles. Yet, the growth in total number of vehicles on road, and the resulting total pollution and total energy consumption removed all gains made by betterment in energy efficiency and emission reduction by automobiles. Energy efficiency measures and pollution control measures did not keep pace with the sales growth in vehicles. The total number of vehicles registered in India has been 5.4 million, 11 million, 33 million, 40 million and 210 million in the years 1981, 1986, 1996, 2000 and 2015. This indicates a 3,500 plus percentage growth in the total number of vehicles between 1981 and 2015. The total number of vehicles sold in India increased between 1, 54, 81,381 in 2010 11 and 2, 04, 69,385 in 2015 16, indicating a 30 plus percentage growth in this five year period. Topic government of India initiatives The government started faster adoption and manufacturing of hybrid and electric vehicles FAME scheme which provides incentives for purchasing electric vehicles. Government is releasing tenders to increase charging infrastructure in the country. Karnataka approved electric vehicle and energy storage policy 2017. The vehicle is covered under Government of India's FAME faster adoption and manufacturing of hybrid and electric vehicles scheme that offers incentives to the electric and hybrid vehicles ranging from 1800 rupees to 29000 rupees for scooters and motorcycles and 1.38 lakh rupees for cars. FAME is a part of National Electric Mobility Mission Plan by Government of India. See also